Enormous. Let's have a look at Jeff from the early highlights. days. You started as a forward, Izzy. When, who and when moved you back? Can you remember the time that, that took place? Now lit by Lee Matthews, of course, as he puts it up and he kicked it straight to that player. Went through the pack, but didn't take the ball out. Beautiful play, finds English with the ball now. He puts it in towards centre half forward. They're all in there, and standing his ground to take the fight. Being for the leading Bizasto. Punch puts the ball to turf. Bizasto still in the van. Has the chance to win possession. Oh, well taken away by Ayres. Ayres gets it up towards Matthews, and strength wins out. The third quarter of watching with Fitzpatrick's left hand tap toward Malin. Tom can't get it. Goat hand passes out. Abbott gives it over to Ayres. Short pass by Carlton on a position that we know roughly as wing position. A good kick by Hunter too. McClure in the pack and a good mark taken at the back of the pack by Ayres. Gave it up. White's handball was effective. Taken by Scott again. He's had a very good first quarter. Wallace for Hawthorne. It's Ayres. Takes the mark. But it didn't come off as it was smothered off the boot. Malin puts the ball forward. Up towards it. A good mark. Right. End of defence by Ayres. Hand passes over. Oh. Back toward Blasket. Blasket kicks it up toward the forward pocket area and a strong mark in defence has been taken once again by Gary Ayres. A good turn of speed, has time to steady and put the kick towards centre half forward, but it's all Hawthorne. As Ayres takes the mark, plays on, puts a high kick over the centre of the ground. Now again on to Sheldon. Sheldon, left centre wing. Oh, Bortolotto went for Polkinghorne, lined him up and missed him and the mark taken down there for Hawthorne by Gary Ayres. Here's on to Malin, the two M's. Malin a shocking kick, it could come off though. There's Ayers again, doing a great job in the back pocket. On the ball, back into play again. Flying high was Hunter before accepted. It's picked up by Ayers, doing a great job down there on the back pocket. Hunter out there at half foot, hooks the ball back. Looking there for Ashton, but not big enough. And a good mark in defence that time, taken by Ayers. And he takes a few good marks down there in defence. To Glascott, flicks it over the top. Hunter on the move like a steam train. Ashman on his own, caught though this time, twice. It's got to be holding the ball, surely. What is? He's not playing a bad game down there, Bob. He's a strong-looking bloke for a back pocket mind of Trovers, isn't he? He's one of the most improved uh, footballers in the game in the last 12 months, Lou. Uh, uh, I think the high for one probably would have cleared Gary Ayers uh, you know, one or two years ago, and he really has proven a great back pocket player. Looking for Buckinara in the time-on period of the first term. Hawthorne still to score a goal. Anything but a good performance. Gary Ayers has been their best player in my book by Sheldon, just short of the centre circle. Wide towards right half forward, Gary Ayres again for Hawthorne taking a good mark. Ashman, Carlton's only bet, Klopp uses his body, but a good mark taken in defence by Loveridge. No, in fact, it's Ayres. On the Dacos. On a Collingwood's best with Jeff Rains in towards the 10 metre square. Ayres, a great mark! And I might add a courageous run. Got a half forward position. Williams flies. He goes down. And there's Ayers going. So this back line has been tremendous. A hand. Well, he was going to go for a hand pass. There's no one within two weeks. So there's a running shot at goal. And he's pulled it through. That's how easy they're doing it. Schimmelbush is snapshot. Off target. Brightus is underneath it. Moore comes in with him. And a mark to Gary Ayers. And a 15 metre penalty to boot. Hey, Peter. Yes. Not the greatest of kicks by Gary Dem uh, by uh, Dench. And the mark taken by Ayres again. Short to Ayres again. Good play by Hawthorne. They looked in trouble there. Most players standing and watching as it comes to Lover. And this young fella's played a great game. He copped the heavy one that time. And... Uh, oh, oh. Well, I, I don't know if that was a, a reportable offence or not. Well, it's play on down here if we see them go back into attack. Water Simpson beaten for it. Some good, heavy, fair body work going on. Tuck the hand pass to Al Halloran. On again to Ayers and from the centre of the ground. Gary Ayers puts the ball high. Hoping for a mark by Peter Knights. He gets away from them. Bathed in sunshine. He kicks to the half forward line. Little Bradley got. She's got a fly from behind and Ayers too much. I know I do. Taken by E to Ayers who can run on. Steady. Shoots in towards the pocket. And Michael Byrne takes the ball on the half volley. Dummy the hand pass. Then straightens up onto the left foot. Puts a long kick towards half forward. Here's a lovely mark. To Wilson. This is dangerous, but it's a beautiful smother. They're out of trouble through Ayers. Well done, Gary Ayers, as he goes up towards the wing. Byrne and Harris. 
and had to do it from behind, Ayres has been very solid, looking towards Judge and finding it. Uses the handball. McMahon overruns it. Suck it off the ground again. Okay, with that half four level, they've been doing that all day since about halfway through the second quarter. Well played by Gary Ayres. That's confidence for you. Goes after it. A long kick over the Hawthorne half four. Then goes the Vanderhaar. Bahaja gets it out to Neagle. Out to Bradbury again. Ayers upsets him. And it's on for Young and Old. We... For the 15 metre penalty. Ball driven over towards centre half four. Oh, there's Ayers in the front position. And he'll get the free kick. Ayers goes for a hand pass now. And this will send the Bombers deep into attack. A beautiful pass. But Ezard dropped it. And what beautiful play on the part of Ayers that time. Streaks away from Ezard. Boots. Clayton doesn't get the favourable bounce. It comes to Gary Ayres to judge. Number seven, Gary Ayres. Number eight, Ayres Domenico. He should look for Quinlan here. Quinlan ducks back. Out he comes, Quinlan. From behind, flies. No mark, though, because the mark has been taken by Ayers. Harris thought of a hand pass, decides to kick long. Reeves opposed to two players. Ayers up high and takes the mark. Austin takes it. Up towards centre wing. And a good mark at the back by Ayers. Ayers. Trouble, Perra, but out of trouble. And he whoops it up towards full forward. Who's there for the Blues? No one at home. And a good mark taken by Gary Ayers. And Russell Green has a panic on his own. That's the way the football heads at the moment. Falls over. Oh, Williams has been a grand player. Kicks over at the mark taken by Ayers. Ayers at the edge of the centre square. The long kick toward the goal. He's ball. Now the boundary umpire had his back to the play then. But he looked at the umpire and the umpire said that was OK. And there's a goal to back pocket player Gary Ayers. And William. A lovely kick once again from Foster. Oh. Ayers! What a great mark! Good effort too. A lovely mark by Daryl Cowie. Over to Cronin. Cronin. Oh, good mark over the back to Ayers. Assistant performers in the Richmond lineup. Down towards Jess. Jess uh, coming in from behind. A little too late in the scene. Got an ear for the Collingwood Rover. He did a settle. Barry Rollings has it. Long breaking kick by Rollings. Good kick, but beautiful mark. Taken by Ayers once again. And Glenn Denning, he's 60 metres out. Kicks it in towards full forward. Ayers is in front and takes the mark. No. I'd like to see them getting more kicks. That's one too many. One hand pass too many. And now Victoria on the rebound. Marku takes the mark. His kick towards half forward again. Burn could get a free kick, but it's a mark to Gary Ayers. Matt is not free kick. Far too far out to score. Now Madden's got to give them something. He's running to Ayers and he's gone for holding the ball. 13 kicks to the Hawthorne Rover, on to Gary Ayres. Here's a short pass up towards centre wing, trying the points in that duel so far. He's gone for a pass, oh. intended for Cole. Ayres over the top, takes the mark. I don't know why Jack didn't have a shot of goal. It's a long, right on top, they go forward again. Ablett is underneath it and marks in front of Morgan. So Hawthorne up towards centre wing, Harvey and Schwab. Good hip and shoulder by Neagle. Leafy and Amedico up in him into the fence. In front is Ayers, and a strong mark. Tell you what, Peter, Neagle's playing a pretty solid game out there. Neagle's... High kick. Only travels about 10 metres, but it went about 25 up in the oh, air. Oh, 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 oh. Well, Vanderhaar just forward. That's OK. The mark taken by Watson, who shoots for goal. It's going close. And marked. I think it is a mark. By Ayers. Right on the line. Essendon. But shell shocked early as the ball drops short, but there's Ayers in the way. Cop one that time uh, from Williams. Williams. Williams puts Essendon into attack. He's looking for Baker. Ayers, great mark. But Neagle break clear. He's upended. Gets the kick up there. Ayers coming in. Down here. What? Oh, great mark to Ayers. Got a finder. Got it. Shoots out a quick hand pass. Once again, it's Hawker. He's caught this time. Holding the ball. Well, they can sense victory, Hawthorne. They're really going out, and this is an extra effort because both sides must be mighty tired, Pete. Number of years, we're running back. We're playing on the wing today. Ayers takes it. Relax. Oh, gee whiz. Kicks a one out. McKenna, who's kicked a couple of goals, to the half-forward line of Pickering. Great mark, Ayers. Over the top. He plays on. 
slides it one across to the wing for another hand pass coming over to Hawkins the ball over the half forward line for Footscray but Ayers is there a very solid player like the rocket Gibraltar takes that mark at half back Gary third quarter first of Hawthorne and now to Essendon maybe the umpire is trying to break up some of the packs and that's perhaps not a bad idea Gary Ayers takes the mark in front of Baker plays half forward mark taken by Baker the two number fours Baker around Ayers no he's not he's caught holding the ball it's a beautiful tackle that's Back towards half forward, underneath it, Baker. Oh, Gary Ayers, superb mark. Ayers from centre field, down towards half forward, trying to find Kennedy in the overhead. Certainly an enormous amount of affection, isn't there, Shane, between opposing players? The wing position by Buckley, the pack set themselves, punched out by Ayers, not a good one. Pushed on again that time by uh, Carlton's Rhodes. The ball is knocked back now. That was Matt, I should say. But it goes now to Ayers. Ayers goes for a short pass. And it's a good one marked here by Kent. By Wallace, he doesn't drop many of those easy ones as McClure drives it up to McKenzie and Lester Smith. At the back as Ayers had to sit that time and takes a strong mark in defence. Approaching the four-minute mark, Carlton still yet to score a goal. They've got Ruxley's opponent up on the boundary line. Boots it over the half-forward line. Bandit got up too well. This allows Ayers to take a well judged mark. Here comes Salmon. This time Ayers has got it. And, uh, you can't, there's no substitution for skill. And there's a strong mark taken that time over the centre line. Knocked to the ground by Ayers. Picked up by Bander. Tries to get to the court. Good tackle, Gary Ayers. Crouch is holding the ball and the umpire agrees. But Law's there. And the ever-reliable Law goes for a long kick. And Ayers takes a good one down there at half-back for uh, Hawthorne. He's kicked it straight to three Hawthorne players, and Gary Ayers is the man in front to take the mark. Now the Bombers picked up by Thompson. Thompson into the goal square. He's got seven at the back over the top of Ayers. Oh, that could be a free kick. Patton on centre wing. Ayers. Ayers from that position. Long kick down to Brereton at the back, and Brereton doesn't let him down. He picked up by the Blond Terrier. That's Neil, but he was too slow. Well tackled by Ayers. He's played a magnificent game today. Best player. No breeze at all. Absolutely ideal conditions for football. Perhaps a little on the cool side. Ayers takes the mark, left half forward flank. Over to Loveridge, a hand pass to Ayers, ever reliable. Short pass of a good one. For Wallace. Scott. Alden. Ayers. Buckenar. He's up towards the half back line, goes wide. Ayers. Another great mark. Two great back pocket players there, a hand pass. This could be okay, fires at the goals, it certainly deserves one, but it won't make the distance, there's a good mark by Ayers. One by Deer, but he didn't get a good knock at it, and picked up for Carlton, by Blackwell, back towards centre field, and the mark was taken by Gary Ayers. And uh, Dill just amazes you every time. Oh, I'm not uh, taking anything away, but... Uh, He's nearly as old as you. <laughs> oh, I didn't think anybody was that old. No, I didn't either. First. He got the ball. <laughs> he was pushed into it, actually. <laughs> yeah, I reckon he was a bit uh, lucky to get that. He's been down there on the forward line, kicked off the ground by Bradley. But there's a good mark by Ayers. This fellow's played pretty solid tonight, too, yes, Bob. He hasn't put a foot wrong, Lou. Bradley boots the ball over the half forward line, but there's the ever reliable. He's playing a great game down there in defence, Ayers. A oh, brilliant hand pass from the Hawthorne rookie, Ruckman. Back to Morris, in turn back to Gary Ayers. What's he doing up there at half forward? It is Ayers, yes. Long shot by Ayers. He's put it through. That was a bias in play on. Kicked off the ground by Harbs. Over to Ayers, doing a great job on Reese Jones. Tapped on by Danko. Beautiful play, and this will be a goal. And at about that. A goal. Well, Hawthorne, uh, Ayers is doing a magnificent job there on the wing on Reese Jones. Not only got Reese Jones covered, Bob, but being a brilliant player himself. So far, he is very high. I got covered much distance. De Pietro Menigo over to Ayers, the man of the moment, as it goes over the half forward line, punched out by Dill. As it go for Bacanara, kicks it off the ground, it's going close, it'll bounce in for Dill. Oh, looks the fortune. That's a good start for Carter for Hawthorne, knocked out by Matt over to Ayers. Ayers gets the ball back to Bacanara. Okay, and it comes to Ayers. Ayers out there on that half-back line looking for a lead. But Hawthorne playing the strong football of Brown getting away from his touch. Good umpiring. Current over to Ayers. Ayers goes long. Dodgic came off. His right hand was bandaged and very swollen. And obviously they're taking a look at that. Gary Ayers taking an excellent mark. and uh, good, good tackle on him by Dunstall. 
Ball booted up to uh, Ayers, and Ayers takes the mark at half forward, decides to play on from the 50 metre line. He gets flattened. It might be a goal, or he'll get another kick. I think he's goal. Goal umpire checking with the field umpire. And it is a goal. So Gary Ayers putting through his first goal. He doesn't kick many. Wayne Muir going to flatten a quick hand pass to Ayers. And look at Ayers go. He's got to panic the run. And nearly lost that, but he recovered okay. What a count from the player within a mile. A long hand pass to... To announce the winner of the Norm Smith medal, Hawthorne's Gary Ayers. Attempted hand pass smothered by Dimitriou. Clatton had a fresh air shot, picked up by John Law. Ayers running the wrong way, gets ridden into the ground by Holmes. A play on call. Ayers running around the mark, long to half forward. Up towards centre field, Gary Ayers for Hawthorne. Jonas late on the scene. Whitman. Holmes cre uh, Buckley creeping over the mark. A lead here now. It'll be OK. He's found Ayers. Ayers straightens up. Balks around. Smith straightens up for the goals the second time. And what's he done with it? It's a goal. He could have marked, perhaps, to Ruse. And Ruse clears for Fitzroy. The centre wing. Good mark, Gary Ayers. And he swings it across to Gary Ayers. And all the hawk backmen have run down towards the centre or further. I think the kick was made for Curran. Uh, one moment, I thought Langford goes straight down the centre. He's kicked it a good 50 metres, hoping Abbott or, or Brett could mark it. Oh, over the back and mark by Ayers. That's a slip catch. Paul Hoare, after taking it out of the centre, drives it forward to the ever reliable Gary Ayers. See, normally a 60 metre kick, and that's no exception. Look at that kick. Healy in the middle of the back, but what a good mark that was. A top mark in defence by Gary Ayers. Out Picked up by Bradley. Back to the half forward line, Ayers in front. Takes a good strong test. Lee, number 21, wins. It comes to Bradley. Hurriedly gets it away and covers good distance too to centre half forward. But a fine chest mark is taken by Ayers. Back Definite beautifully by Larkin. And steal from 55 metres. Kick smothered. German, great tackle Ayers. Holding the ball. Madden, Madden at centre half forward. Kicks it long. Looking up there for Gallagher, but a good mark taken by Gary Ayers. And he repels that very promising Carlton attack. Comes to half-back. Mr Smith. But Hawks had the numbers. Ayers way up from defence. Almost to the wing. Now to Brereton. Good play, Hawthorne. Chance for Murphy. He kicks it off the ground again. Ayers. Oh, does it well. Eludes the tackle. Feeds them. Chance for Gleeson. Puts it up towards full forward. At the back, Ayers. Clear at half-back. Ayers. 35 metres in the clear. Baxter, you've got to go. He does. Oh, he upsets Muir. Ayers just enough. But Ayers regains his composure. Stands up. Kicks to Bacanara. A tap on. Green. Standing start. Brereton or Ayers. And another defender. Another one to Ayers. Around them too easily. Ayers kicks it. Austin under pressure. Ayers shoots for goal. Henwood over the centre wing. Burn out of position. Ayers, who's a beautiful judge, gives Wright something to go on with. Ayers should have been up a bit further. Wright's kick towards centre half forward. Kappa. Oh, what a mark, Ayers. What a brilliant mark by Gary Ayers. Hope he hasn't missed this up. Trip goes back. Ayers or Langford or Mew. It's Ayers. What a defensive line the Hawks have. What a forward line. That one all right. And he chips it back. Oh, what a foolish mistake. What a foolish man. He could have been in front sort of two points behind. The Hawks capital. Geelong playing better, handling it better. Bairstow takes the handball. Little push against Cameron to Ayers, but uh, it won't be on. 
There's Foxes his own handball and delightfully passes to Russo. Beautiful backing up by Ayres. <laughs> he couldn't get the bounce. Now he does. Oh, the Hawks are looking good. To Healy, smothered. In when Hawk always he's hit very, very hard. Paul Hawk and the umpire said it was an illegal tackle on Hawk. But that'll, let's have a good look at this one. In he comes. A bit high. Oh, that was hip and shoulder from Gary Ayres. Tackled, but still able to get boot to ball. Gary Ayres comes out, picks it up on the half volley. Hand passes over to Russell Green. The hand pass came to Newport from Campbell. A bit love it, I should say. Not Campbell, but that's a good mark by Ayres. For Hawthorne, Greg Deer, oh, he's beaten for that one there. Greg, this is Gary Ayres, a great finals competitor, this man, as he gets it across the length. Short pass into Ayres. Ayres around the outer side. Mark Tommy Dixon used to play full forward. He's gone for a pass on this occasion. That's effective. And it is uh, a mark to Gary Ayres. Had to have marked two handballs tonight. And naturally a chance for his first goal. He doesn't kick many. He's kicked it like a back pocket player. Has he or is it coming back? It's come back. I think it's a goal. Out wide. Centre wing. Loken. And Ayres. Good to see Ayres back. Oh, tremendous play, Gary Ayres. And certainly know who's playing. Up from goal. Iron Munger. Straight to Whitman. Whitman. A hurry kick. Oh, gee. Is uh, Gary Ayres playing well? And Billy now and have taken three marks already. Well, Ayres, a brilliant quarter so far from 45 metres. A lovely looking drop punt, and that's another goal to the Hawks. A long way up from goal. Taylor's made the lead. He should get to this one. No, nope. he's from behind. There's Ayres. Oh, gee. Good mark. Oh. It's to play on. Demetrio not paying attention on the mark. Scott goes down towards half foot. Big pack. Ayres, great mark. Gets it across to Sheldon, right on the boundary line. He hooks it down towards half forward. Here's the big mark over the top. At the moment, Dyer. St Kilda over the 50 metre line, but Ayres is there. Haynes spins out, goes backwards to give himself some room. The two number sevens, Gary Ayres. Uh, can he get clear? He's on the left foot. Hooks it high, back in towards full forward. Coleman is there. Can he get front spot? No, he can't. A fine effort by Ayres to claim the mark. To Wilson, because he was covered. But back it comes to Williams. Oh, Ayres nearly ran through. Him. Country. Over the top, it's fisted out of his hands. At the back is Ayres. A sweeping handball meant for Platten. He's under tremendous pressure. His kick goes wide. It's taken by Ayres, who sends a 20-metre hand pass to Platten. Shepherding will see him clear. And between centre and half forward, he goes long towards Dunstall and Curran. Curran! Now, Danaher will beat him to it. This is Terry Danaher, the captain. Oh, good play by Ayres. Tuck wins. High hand pass. Oh, look at the tackle by Ayres. Well, the umpire said it was high. No. O'Donnell's pass wide. Terry Danaher at full forward. Ayres, what a pick up by Gary Ayres. Picked up by Buick. A clever kick to Madden. Two on one Essendon. Ayres has got to beat both of them and does. Gary Ayres. And what a kick by Ayres. Brilliant football. What? Nice hand pass. Fine swab. Swab a quick kick. He's found a teammate and a good mark there too to Gary Ayres. He's in the forward pocket and they're sorting things out here and the players are sorting them out. Ayres is in there. Showing great courage was Healy diving on top of the football. Down. Lovett's over the ball. There's the time remaining. Morrissey off the ground working a forward for the Hawks. Taken by Ayres. Towards half forward he goes. Long kick towards a vacant goal square. Dunstall is back. Mark Earl Spalding plays on around you. Melbourne desperately need a goal. Long kick towards the kickoff line, but Gary Ayres, the Hawthorne vice captain, a starring role so far this afternoon. Gets him. Lyon left it behind. McGuinness. Love it. Love it. Kicks down towards the pocket. Oh, Gary Ayres. Uncontested. Bacanara. He's a Dia trying to get it towards the boundary line. Guess who's got it? Ayres. This boy comes back to Dia. Working hard this afternoon. Untidy kick, but Ayers gathers the ball just inside the boundary line. What a star he's been. He finds Morrissey this time. Stretcher's got it now behind the pack. Goes with a left foot towards half forward. Ayers, great mark, Ayers. Superb mark. He misjudged it initially. He had to compensate for that. He was going back into unexplored territory. Members side with a kick. Diffie Domenico couldn't take the mark. Ayers again. In the Kevin players there. Comes out from Flint off to Lovell. Kick very wide. Oh, yes. <laughs> Brilliant game. 
remarkable mark that one Ayers members side with a kick the Norm Smith medal has been won by a unanimous vote to Mr Gary Ayers Exactly that. Taylor and Ayers. Taylor in front. Ayers brilliant. That was a magnificent mark under pressure as he brings it towards home. No vision there. He uh, didn't see the man coming. Oh, Gary Ayers. Too strong, as Don Scott said earlier. Look at that play by Ayers to Brereton. Magnificent. And Carlton get the ball out of the centre through the ubiquitous Bradley. Looks for Silvani. Can't take a strong mark for Gary Ayers. <laughs> Hawthorne have kicked the only four goals for the third term. Here's Gary Ayers. Lifting them in the middle. And the bounce, oh, that even favoured Hawthorne as Ayres has made a big difference. Oh, brilliantly done to Whitman. Well played, Gary Ayres. Brereton. Kick up to the half forward line. Comes to the back to Collins. Wide to Ayres. Ayres, a beautiful hand pass. Morrissey again. Goes for another one. And has kicked another one. Start at half time. A sensational effort. Let's see if they can come back the Cats. It'll be hard. Oh, here they come again, Condendu, Ayers, Ayers straightens up, Gary Ayers. Oh, it could be another one. Yes, I think that's the end of Geelong. Yep. Still going. Dippy a minute ago, tries to tap it back. A loose ball is with Ayers. Ayers onto the left foot. Has a puck shot at goal. And don't tell me he's put it through, he has. I assume it, so the youngster called upon to do the ruck work. He scrambled it further forward. He followed up his own ruck work and kicked it to this man, Ayers. Good tuck. Back it comes to Reynoldson, and here's an excellent mark under the conditions to mark in front of Mark Williams. Brilliantly Danny Frawley, out of defence, Ayers with the sit, and a mark. Gary Ayers, oh he's found a loose man there. Hi, where's Dunstall, there he is. Hawthorne players really do know when Dunstall is on the move. And so quick there Peter too. To Ayers, and a goal. Long kick though to the goal square. Salmon keeps his footing but won't quite get there. But comes off Ayers. Hawthorne defence under pressure. But Gary Ayers a big game player. A beautiful clearing kick to Bacanara. In this time, you know, he goes wide. Gary Ayers is out there at the back and uh, he is a very good player. Kicks it wide. Ayers has done a great job on Watson. Ayers taps it on. A great finals player and goes and gets the ball. There's a fight on behind the players beautifully. Goes short, it's a bad pass, Gary Ayers, oh, strong play Ayers. Ayers a long kick to the half-forward line, another loose man there for Hawthorne. Collins dragged off it, Brown was an opportunity, Wade's one bump, claimed by McGuinness, Ablett put down, Ayers pressed into him, goes, in goes Yates, Boss comes away with the ball, drives it around the outer side, in front Ayers, almost a spectacular mark, in fact it's played. Again, Ayers down in the picture, but Tuck does nicely, gets it across, just paddling it towards Ayers, who hooks it around the boundary, from behind, Boss should have punched. Taken, chance now for Flanagan, and he busses his way out, but Ayers is there to tidy up for Hawthorne. Ayers kick, high, in towards the forward pocket, and Dunstall takes the mark, and Gary Ayers, here he comes. Would be very disappointed, Gary Ayers, he injured it, he's died, had to sit out the last Come quarter, but his contribution... No Hawthorne have got the break. But it's been footy at its best. 14 14 to 11 7. Ayers. Schultz misread it. Kennedy. Yep, a little too easily. Darcy's kick straight up the ground. But Ayers nudges his opponent excellent. Stephen Hawking's been quiet. Lindner. Ayers. Outnumbered with McGuinness. And Gary Ayers, who's played a typical game with seven kicks and five handballs, to Anderson. On starting to lift, Kennedy to Ayers from 50 metres, Gary Ayers straightens up, it's another one of the Hawks, are they coming back? Edwards, Paul Deere puts his body in and then yes, it's good decision. Play on the umpire calls, Gary Ayers picks it up onto the left foot and slams it through for a goal to the Hawks. On the far cry from them in their prime, but their keys in those attacking positions not there. Oh Ayers, the mark is paid came over the mark that time momentarily Ayers gets the goal Ray Jenke up to full forward Ayers is there leaps high punches down comes back to Ayers he goes for goal gets it 
this one. Whitman's got it now. Chris Whitman goes wide for Ayres again. How did he get that far out in the open? Manikin up. Well, Ayres has been better since he was injured and moved down to the forward line. Gary Ayres from 50 metres leans back on this one. A beauty! Three goals to Gary Ayres. To half forward line. Morrissey has the ball punched away from him, but Pritchard roves brilliantly, kicks up towards Ayres, and Ayres has got the mark. Lovely forward work there by Hawthorne, and Ayres well lining up from 40 metres out. Probably think this is a picnic up on the forward line, having a nice break. And nice passes he's getting to. And it's a nice kick by Ayres. He wants to be a full forward today. He's put that one right through. The umpire says OK. Kick up towards half forward. Onto it as Ayres, 50 metres out. Goes for goal with a bomb. It's long, it's high, and it's handsome. Four long, up towards Burton. Sandwich between a couple of Brisbane players. Lears there, knocks it down to the ground. The ball uh, emerges, picked up by Morrissey. Hand pass onto Ayres. Ayres steps over a player. Magically kicks towards goal and has put it through with as much poise as you would ever, ever see. Six days to go. Anyway, a week is a long time everywhere. As Collins, a neat foot pass in towards the forward pocket near the cricketer's gate. And it's been marked by Ayres. 12 metres in from the boundary line. Plenty of opening, drop punts. It looks to be perfect from here. It's a beautiful kick by Gary Ayres for his third. On the awkward half volley. Swings it with the left boot towards Gary Ayres from behind. Takes a screamer. Shaped a hand pass. The umpire says play on. He says OK and pops it through with the left boot. Fourth goal to Ayres. On a Melbourne trail by nine points at the 20 minute mark 15 14 104 Essendon Melbourne 14 11 95. It's taken a very good mark just meters out from goal and from the center bounce it was all Hawthorne down the ground Lawrence chipped in with the possession Ayers has kicked his uh, fifth goal hard against the boundary line to Longmire who got the kick initially off great tackle front on Ayers tap on a chance for McGuinness to get it away he does Pull back, in towards full forward. Dunstall. Oh, Burton. Damn it, Burton goes. Brilliantly done to Hudson, to Ayres. And Ayres from 30 metres. Brilliant. Ayres loses uh, Don Scott said a moment ago because of Kranzberg's position. The out of position. Well, Langford just ran about 25 metres there. No free kick, Ayres. To receive the cup. Congratulations, Barry. He's off the hand pass. Quick person for Hawkins. One out with Ayers. Hawkins got underneath the ball and Ayers took the mark. Hawkins kicks it high. Royal versus Ayres. Oh, strength and experience by Gary Ayres. 50 metres out the short pass. And Gary Ayres is marked. Time ticking away. One minute and 50. Cleverly to Dunstall. Oh, Dunstall to Ayres. Ayres an open goal. It runs around on the left foot. It's all too easy. Goal to Ayres. Yes, Sandy. Another snap at goal. Becoming very repetitive. Another goal, and Gary is enjoying this. Down goes McKenna. Away comes Condon. Kicks it down to half forward. Ayres. Good mark. Off the ball. Meantime, Paul Deer goes long towards full forward. Jarman. Almost a spectacular mark. Ayres picks it up 12 metres out and kicks a goal. A belated... I've seen a beautiful hand pass across now to Hudson. Hudson goes short towards Ayres, who dives forward and has taken the mark. 45 metres out from goal. Uh, scrambly football at the moment and flicked out towards Tuck. Tuck picks it up and it's a quick snap by Jinky. Jinky snap it was Ayers. Ayers has stepped towards goal and has put it through. So the full taken by Hudson. Straight down the ground. Hudson sees a two-hour duel between Kernahan and Ayers. Ayers wins out, takes the mark, plays on and puts it through the centre for his second goal. Two goals towards Anderson in the forward pocket. Anderson plays on down there towards Ayers, and Ayers takes a great mark in the goal square. And he's used his body well, the siren sounds, but Gary Ayers will put the ball right through the middle to take Hawthorne to 18-14. A little while.
result, but Hawthorne get the first goal of the game. The ball is punched towards the uh, Essendon half-forward area, picked up by Ayres, and under a little bit of pressure, Mark to Somerville at half-back. He plays on quickly and kicks it to centre wing. One-on-one, -on -one, Ayres. Oh. Well, Gavin Brown, a quick kick to the half-forward line. Out comes Ayres in front of Dave Cox. Good strong mark. Feeds out the hand pass. Schultz goes again. High kick down towards the attacking 50. Oh, what a good mark. Ezard running back, can't control it. Whitman off the ground, Ayres injured. Coming on to replace Dunsell, can he go? He has! Still, Hudson sends Hawthorne forward, Anderson under the ball. I doubt he'll ever be a state full back. Ayres getting in position for a soccer attempt. Now he picks oh. up and goes with the injured leg and kicks a goal. Sends him to half forward. Bruns a veteran. Airs over the top. Didn't get first touch. Play on. And goalless on one occasion. Pete possessions. Hawthorne 62 to 33. Yes, they really are dominating. There's Airs, a great mark. He's a terrific finals player. Pritchard couldn't control it. Matera now a chance. Met very solidly by Airs. Off the ground, Jenky. Airs in the front spot. Couldn't take it. Wilson with him now. Airs did it work. On the other side wing. Now towards the attacking 50, Ayres reads it best in flight. Good mark. Oh. Morrissey, Sumix to pressure him. Morrissey under pressure, thumps it away towards Ayres. And I thought Ayres was going to concede and let it go out of play. Kept it in and kicks it to Lawrence. Towards half forward, all Hawthorne, three against one. But the one is heady and he's all class. But Ayres is too good. Great shepherd by Tuck. Away at... Hart from a long way out. Bangs a high one. Outnumbered, uh, Wilson just... Ease. Wilson's hip and shoulder okay. Matera, Pritchard with him. Off the ground by Ayres, who's had a very, very strong start to think about it. Lamb's going to be under pressure. A terrible handball. For Gowers, over the top main wearing. This is Ayres behind. All the time in the world, Gary Ayres. Down towards half forward, storming up the ground. There's the fight going on. But the important play was at the other end. With Condon running into an open goal at 10-5. Hart with him. Hart wins this time, Ayres, who started magnificently to Brereton. Forward and Sumich, Langford gets it first on it, Ayres again, impenetrable, he goes towards the outer side, Gowers to... Number, Number seven, seven, his fifth, fifth premiership, premiership with the Hawks, Gary Ayres. mark but he gets to get back very very quickly Ayers is there to give him a bit of a help out and kicks it high towards the wing Hawks on quickly elected not to take the shot in towards goal that's a long kick Wilden gets up high kick coming from oh. uh, there's Stevens with a quick kick oh it's Gary Ayers waiting underneath this and Marks and they've got loose men Hawthorne this is when they rebound now let's see how Wait, Hawthorne for winning the final tonight there you go Points. Ayers from the back pocket to Platten on the half-back line. 
Heathers chased by Jarman, who looks as though he may be playing on Bairstow. Up towards full foot is. Well done, Gary. Ayers. The congestion was it? No, Newport's taking the kick. Goes towards the pocket. Ayers does brilliantly. Your kick from about 52 metres. It'll land just outside the goal square. Plenty of numbers down there for the Hawthorne team against Bennett. And the mark has been taken by Gary Ayres beneath the scoreboard. Stand front and took the mark with Dunstall bearing down. Gives a hand pass to Lovett, but his kick is beautifully marked by Ayres. Well, from Dunstall, it goes without saying, performing great things at 4-4 again. Ayres comes in and kicks a goal. And Ayres and Langford have both scored majors for the Hawks. At the 24 minute mark. Attacking side of the centre. Now a kick that just limps up towards 50. Out comes Ayres and takes a beauty. He's next, Darren Bennett should have a shot from there. He's underneath it. There's plenty on it. He's a good rooster for football, but it's been marked by Gary Ayres. Goes back to Ayres. Nothing much gain there. Ayres with his left foot as a result. Puts it very high down towards the kickoff line. And the mark is held by Gow as well. Oh, a chance to sneak away from McKenna. He kicks up towards Ayres. The skipper takes a good mark. Roosman brought it straight away and got it over towards... Uh, uh, Hart, he drives right up towards the full Bears will drive them into attack from centre circle right down towards the full forward position between centre half forward and full forward and Ayers backed his judgment beautifully. Gives a hand. Take the mark. But gathers his own crumbs. Round the corner. Ayers, courageous mark. And keeps on going the skipper. Beautiful play. Well trapped by Michael McLean. He weaves his way through, brings it out the halfback. Ayers with strength, a good mark. Now he plays on, he's got loose men everywhere here. Don't you be quiet. <laughs> I bet I was shutting up, is not I? In towards half a Jason Taylor again, but it's a mark for Gary Ayers in front. He gives it back. Backland Deer easily. On the left boot to pull forward. A half forward flank. Ayers got rid of McCormack to take the mark. Goes on quickly. Across to Jarman, they want a big lift from him. On to Ayers. Ayers brings it wide. Oh, look at this. Gowers, no one near him. Andrew Jarman to Scott Lee. Lee to the half foot line. Ayers in front. He's the only one who really went for it, Gary Ayers. Deer at the back. Can't take the mark. Here's Gary Ayers racing at it. Gary Ayers brings it in towards half forward. This is Con